Hi guys and welcome, I am Robonix and this is Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order Part 6 on PlayStation 4. If you enjoy any of this content then please feel free to like, subscribe and don't forget to ring that notification bell. Hope you enjoy this video, let's get started. Been, I've left it too long. It's been like over a week since I last played this, so I'm kind of. We, we unlocked new skills, so I was going to go over these and see what they were. So we have just finished this area. We are. We're just about to make our way back to the beginning. Um, so let's check out the survival tree so far. So we've gained three new skills on this side. Um, Agile deflection. Cal automatically deflects the blaster bolts while he is sprinting or wall running. Enhance, uh, Cal's maximum life is increased, always a bonus. Uh, Cal's, uh, Cal recovers additional life when using a stim canister from BD1. Uh, <laughs> I think we'll probably be putting points into those. Uh, let's go to the other side, which is our force. Uh, hold and push can allow Cal to push groups of enemies and stagger large enemies. Cal regains more force when he defeats an enemy and regains some force when he hits a blocking enemy. Holding slow allows Cal to slow his target for a longer duration. Holding slow allows Cal to slow all targets around him, increasing slow duration on target enemies. Cal's maximum force is increased. Uh, so again, some like, good abilities there. Um, and then we have lightsaber, the lightsaber tree. Um, increases the distance that Cal can travel when using dash strike. An airborne attack that allows Cal to push away nearby enemies when he lands. Attacking after a quick evade allows Cal to quickly perform a kick attack. Waiting longer to press attack after Cal swings his lightsaber allows him to perform a special attack with increased range. An attacking out of sprint allows Cal to perform a special lightsaber attack. Uh, so they will be nice. Um, but I am going to, uh, we definitely need to increase the heal. And we're going to increase maximum life as well. I feel like they're kind of needed at this point. Um... Alright, yeah, I don't think there's anything else we can do in these areas. That's where we came from. So we got some new, new places that we can go to as well. Um, on all these areas. Okay. Let's have a look down here first. Just yet. Then we need uh, a double jump for that, maybe. <coughs> but there's definitely some stuff over this way we can try and do.
Well, that was definitely a lot easier. So we can force push, push his core out. Okay, I'm not sure what we're meant to do here. It says it's available. What do we do with this one now? There's got to be another spear somewhere. Okay, so there's another hole <laughs> there. And there's another one there.
Don't fall behind, BD1. Okay, so this is the like starting area where we uh, jumped over. Hey, didn't we see one of these spears on the way in? We did swing on it, didn't we? I wonder if there's a way to get it down. Okay, so we it's hinting that we use that we are to use this one. Okay, so I guess we just let that come around again, and then... No... So we just gotta wait and kind of like force, force push it? Or can we... Just stop it? We can. So we should stop it and then push. If we're going to get it at the right time anyway. Okay, so it looks like this is the kind of shortcut to get back. And then we just push that off to travel back up. Um, <clears throat> so before we do that, we're just going to have a look. Uh, I might as well, because it just seems like a bit silly just to come back just to do this little bit. So I'm going to see if we can actually do this, this area.
purpose was deliberately destroyed. I can still feel the hate of the act. That's it. Before we'd have at least got something good. Um, now, how do we get back up here? Looks like we can climb up anyway. Zephyr went to Kashyyyk. Cordova mentioned someone named Tarful. Ah, a Wookiee chieftain. They were old friends. Think he's still around? There's only one way to find out. We have to go to Kashyyyk. So now we've got some uh, some troopers to fight on the way back. So let's rest for a bit. I feel like I may have... I feel like I might have missed something um, down here. Possibly. Okay, but there's some areas in here we can now, like, Did we just open the way well. for the Empire? Where did you come from? Yeah! <laughs> 
Take this! Ah! I'm not losing focus, Jedi! I need to brush up a bit on my combat because we can use force abilities. Force push. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. Um. Get back up there. We have to go a long way around. Getting a strange feeling from this one. Ancient Zepho gathered here. I wonder why. Get from here. Is everyone going to respawn around me? Let's try it. Okay. 
Uh, just some of them. Okay, we can deal with that. Some droids, some droids may have the ability to slice in and control probes functions, capable of being physically maneuvered and used as a weapon. The Sinister Imperial Probe Droid, also known as a probot, uh, was an explore, exploration and reconnaissance unit deployed by the Galactic Empire. This lightly armored probe is equipped with six manipulator arms extending from a central pod and several retractable sensor arms for gathering samples. High resolution receivers and sensors cover the central brain core, including motion, acoustic, sonic, and seismic sensors, a radiation meter, magnetic imager, and hollow, hollow camera. It carries an atmosphere sensor and hovers on a repulse, repulsory lift generator capable of maneuvering most terrain. Its primary directive is recon and surveillance of potential threats to the Empire, including insurgents, fugitives, and specialized targets. So what are we coming here for? Doesn't really look like there's anything that we can do. Just seeing if there's anything else, anywhere else we can get to in this map with these vents. Doesn't look like there is. That looks like a little opening. Well, I can't really see anywhere to like climb up there. Let's have a look. Continue excavating. I want rare artifacts, not useless trinkets. <clears throat> uh, so should we just go down?
didn't mean to do that. Okay, so it just takes us back here. <laughs> yeah. um. oh, that doesn't look like we can use it again to go back down. Okay. Let's do that again. What the hell? No! No! Just have a quick look at these skill trees. Uh, might as well get that. Saves me doing it. So all these places look really nice so far. down there. I want to get my stuff back. <coughs> Four of these guys. Oh my god! Just relentless. I need to kind of get another heal in.
help. Oh, okay. What was in there? A uh, new poncho material acquired. <clears throat> this is like really hard when they're all like when they surround you. There's that guy, he just like Oh we just got force pushed through the wall. Have a rest. We're not going back down there again. We've got what we needed uh, from that chest. Is this re that's reset as well. Jotaz, strong but slow, strike after dodging an attack, rapid strikes and or unconventional attacks will enrage and confuse the creature. Uh, the Jotaz is a formidable and highly aggressive predator that utilizes brute strength to establish supremacy. A thick hide provides armor-like defensive support, but vulnerabilities may exist along the abdomen region where the skin is thinnest. What this creature lacks in speed is supplemented by forceful blows and an impressive reach of long forearms. What is that noise that keeps yeah, going on? But yeah, so I guess there's no point in trying to like parry that, it's just a dodge and attack kind of thing. And let's see what he left up here. Imperial officer was trying to hide a relic down here. There was a cave in. She became trapped and never escaped. a bit too far to reach. Great, we've got some more jumping things to do.
appreciate it. I was just full for it. Let's go get our stuff back. Okay, so there's another one there. Is that just going to take me... Somewhere where I can't get back from? Oh god, the amount of bugs in this game. This game is absolutely fantastic, but the amount of bugs in there kind of puts a, like, a dampener on it. It brings it down a bit. Um, it's just, there's just a lot of like uh, uh, pop-ins that happen. Pop out stuff that's just not loaded. And uh, yeah, just some of the. Just some of the other, there's, you know, issues with the graphics of the game as well. Nice job. Uh, excavation equipment, Imperial excavation equipment, the level of dust. Suggests it's been sitting here a long time. Uh, okay, so there's a slide that we can come back down through. Uh, it's probably going to be a good idea to rest right here. Was killed by a cave-in. Imperial excavation is making these tunnels unstable. Uh, 
Uh, okay, so I just guess we head back down this way. Okay, so I think that leads back. Um, oh, no, don't do that. Just need one hit. That looks like a separate way down as well. So there's more areas that like carry on. Um, so let's head up here. We see her. I'm under an Imperial dig site. It got a lot further than we thought. We can't worry about that now. The Empire's identified you as the Jedi from Braca. They're searching for the Mantis as we speak. Can't you move the Mantis? It's too risky to start the engine. Its power discharge will draw their attention immediately. I'll be back as fast as I can. Okay. Brilliant. That's gonna be fun to get past. Oh, okay, and well, that takes us back to the beginning. Uh, I should explore these little bits down here as well. Whoa, what the hell? Oh my god, we did it. Finally. We'll be much of a fight. So fast. You can't escape us. Don't let us. So we've got no health, no heals. Brilliant.
PD-1? Just making sure you're still there. I've got him! Up there! Watch my back! Seer, I just took down a trooper wearing black and red armor. The same type from Baraka. A purge trooper. Their only purpose is to hunt Jedi. Are the Inquisitors coming? It's possible, but we're far from Baraka. They might think purge troopers are enough. Or they could be stalling you on purpose. Stay wary. Oh man, that was a bit of a challenge. That's an excellent find. It will need my personal evaluation. The tool dropped in an e excitement over a mysterious find by a worker during the excavation. It appears they found what they were looking for. Okay. Oh, something was in there. Ooh, new skin. <laughs> new lightsaber material. Shortcut unlocked. Oh, okay. And this takes us all the way back uh, around there. Sound of destruction that MK270 Imperium pulverizers are 
Crucial for Project Agua Aga, as the icy barrier of Zephyr's cave system require an incredible amount of power to break through. Even the Empire's specialized souls are not significant, sufficient to break through this ice on their own. Need a stem. Uh, where's our little drop down? There it is. Can I get some help? <laughs> Good timing. I just rolled off the edge there. Which is never a good idea. Hello. Right. You and him. Ah. I can take you out, no problem. Come back here and fight. Ah. We'll stay on you. So for these ones, we want to get a uh, ah. a block and then a counter straight away. So long just to get over here. Uh, okay, let's have a little rest. Let's get one. Right when they're about to. They don't always have a tell though. BD1! Can I get some help? Was there anywhere? There's, so there's a few more places we can go to on this map. I'm just going to quickly have a look. Um, Oh, there's one inside as well. Cal, we've got a walker firing on us and our weapons are down. Is that him? Tell him he better get his butt. Hold on, I'm on my way. Lock tight.
TST. Susceptible to sabotage of its own grenades and missiles. Legs are vulnerable. The all terrain scout transport, uh, also known as the scout walker, is a lightweight bipedal two person transport deployed for ground force support in the, Gal in the Galactic Empire. They were often used for swift reconnaissance and targeting the smaller threats that evaded the larger uh, attacks. Uh, Equipped with chain mounted medium blaster cannons capable of firing at a range of two clicks, as well as side cannons armed with rockets and concussion grenades targeting enemy vehicles and ground troops at close range. Um, so yeah. I'll, I'll go back there in a minute. There's just like some a uh, few little doors I want to quickly quickly check out. Okay, so that's at the bottom. I know where that one is. It's kind of one that I wanted to explore at the start. I kind of like. Watch out for the pillar. They're dangerous. Break's over. I understand. Charge forward. <laughs> Okay, so this did not lead to anyone. Jedi! Yeah. You and him! Oh. Back. I hope reinforcements are on the way. down here like this is one of the first places I went to but I kind of like just ran back but this just opens a, a shortcut back to the starting area yeah but there's also just one more door I want to try before I close out this episode Oxygen. 
to that. This way back is. Um, oh, I don't know, but there's a, a door over this way. Um, just have a quick rest up. again. Where's this, uh, this is all the way over there. I can't re even remember how I got back to the beginning. I think I had to go all the way back down. Um, okay, so we'll just quickly try and run to this uh, door down here, which is... the hell? Oh, 
Come on. <laughs> well, these uh, things are annoying. There's like... Okay, so we must have opened like a lot of those throughout the map. So now... Okay. Need to run back up there, but... anywhere. Yeah, it just lets us jump over there, which I'm pretty sure we could have done anyway. So I think we can just access this. Door. Oof. Wasn't expecting this. It's a giant Zepho statue. Kind of thought there would be Zepho stuff inside. I think I could replace yours with this. Let's get you fixed up. How's that? <laughs> Wanna try it out?
crap. Oh, close. Okay, so we've got the scomp link, which means we can uh, access more areas. Um, quite a few more areas, actually. Quite nice, but we're going to have to save that for another time, I think, if this video has <laughs> ran on way too long. Um, let's just rest here. Oh, man. Uh, yeah, so this place was hard. Um, We, uh, we counted like quite a few difficulties, came across many more bugs again as well. Uh, you know, on the way back, we haven't even left the planet. We're just discovering like new locations and stuff. Um, you know, we've got the scomp link now, so there's, uh, we can get even more chests and unlock more areas. We've got force push, uh, you know, which just adds to that. Uh, so yeah, all, all good. She needs to try now. So I might get some of these. I'm not sure which ones I want to get around. But for now, we're just going to end this video. Because like I said, way too long. Uh, okay, so thank you very much, guys. If you've uh, you know, watched this far into the video, it's been a very long video. Um, I'm going to have to cut down some of the loading times uh, for this. But yeah, uh, once again, if you like any of this content, please click the like and subscribe buttons. Don't forget to hit that notification bell and hopefully see you guys in the next video. Take care.